committed to open parks and programs for all to participate and enjoy. Welcome to Chicago at Play. The Chicago Park District has made it a priority to ensure that any person, regardless of age or physical disability, can have access to all parks and programs. Continued improvement to park infrastructure is part of that vision. Our task right now is to take the parks that have no accessibility of any sort and upgrade them to the current level. And sometimes you go beyond and exceed uh, the requirements. This Capital Improvement Plan will give us uh, an opportunity to make field houses more accessible. Basic entry modifications for accessibility as well as bathrooms. But not stop there, going beyond and looking at the entire uh, interior structures as well as the exteriors of parks. The release of $25 million in bonds could bring the city parks into compliance with federal disability standards. From field houses to lakefront trails, some of the 570 parks within the park district need these accessibility renovations. We want to add more beach walks than we presently have at our beaches. We're up to uh, 15 in 08. We want to add a couple more in 09. Uh, some of them had mats. We now want to use solid surface beach walks as much as we can, uh, making sure that the end of the walk uh, ends at the water line or possibly has a ramp in some cases that goes down into the water. We want to make sure there are smooth transition points off of the concrete pad. Once we have that accessibility to the beach, we are required to have some sort of facility for the, for the people to use the beach houses. So now the beach houses have been upgraded as well. Our wonderful bike paths along the way are accessible to people in wheeled vehicles, whether it's just someone taking a stroll in a wheelchair with a loved one, or hand cyclists. It's very popular these days among people with disabilities. City playgrounds are also getting a makeover, allowing kids and adults the opportunity to come out and play. We're always looking for more innovative pieces of playground equipment and more innovative ways to design new playgrounds. But the basic things are the soft surface, uh, then add ADA swings, and make sure that there are ground and elevated elements that are fun for kids with disabilities and for kids without disabilities. All of the new playgrounds uh, that are all accessible at grade, um, there's no raised levels. So almost everyone with any kind of difficulty or accessibility issue can actually use the playground and enjoy it. In terms of facilities that were built for people with disabilities, uh, the uh, White Sox field, the so-called uh, Miracle Field soft surface on the south side, and our uh, asphalt uh, wheelchair softball field that was designed uh, for adults to play wheelchair softball on the north side at the uh, California Park and Veterans Sports Center. These are bellwether facilities, more of which we want to find space for. Community gardens are also receiving extra attention as a result of the interest in accessible garden beds. Some of the very special um, projects that we've done is the raised gardens. The challenge in this one was just not only to make the beds accessible to a certain height, but also the path that leads up to it accessible. And then at the same token, we have to make sure that there's parking available in the park, all the access paths are accessible, smooth, and the transitions are good. And then also the field house that's next to it is also accessible so people can get in there and use the washrooms and the other amenities that are in the park. When you look at one little piece, you have to sort of, it triggers other items, other, you know, uh, amenities that, has, that have to be upgraded as well. Every aspect of the Park District's facilities are being examined to determine the best way to serve the community so that everyone can benefit and enjoy all the Chicago Park District has to offer. With this initiative, we are trying to make our parks as accessible as possible and benefit all people in Chicago and create a kind of prototype for other parks to take lead from. We really feel it's about time that uh, our parks become more accessible. So it's, it's really exciting, uh, this new bond issue, this uh, accelerated capital uh, improvement plan initiative uh, to make parks accessible and usable by as many people as, as possible. 